हेलो एवरीबडी एंड वेलकम बैक वंस अगेन टू आर ऑनलाइन सेशन स्टूडेंट्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू द चैप्टर ऑन विंग्स ऑफ करेज द चैप्टर ऑन विंग्स ऑफ करेज डिस्क्राइब्स द ब्रेव डीड्स ऑफ एयरफोर्स मार्शल अर्जन सिंह इट ऑल्सो डिस्क्राइब्स हाउ ही फॉट मेनी इम्पॉर्टेंट बैटल्स फॉर द कंट्री Air Force Marshal Arjun Singh an icon icon means ideal such a person whose example can be followed by others of India's military history will always be remembered as a war hero who had successfully led here led means guided a young IAF the full form of IAF is Indian Air Force during the 1965 indo-pak war why does the co- writer call it young iaf because recently indian air force was established that's why the writer calls it as young iaf the only officer to attain the highest post of marshal attain means to achieve the air force equivalent equivalent means equal to the army's five star field marshal singh was a fearless and exceptional pilot exceptional means outstanding pilot who had flown more than 60 different types of aircraft he played a major role in transforming the iaf means he was responsible for the most important changes which took place in indian air force at that point of time into one of the most potent potent means powerful or effective air forces globally globally means all over the world and the fourth biggest into the world his contribution to the indian air force is monumental monumental means of great importance to the least the iaf grew with him means the iaf developed with him he was the epitome epitome means a perfect example of military leadership in classical sense and it is therefore not surprising that he was honored with the rank of air force marshal former vice chief of iaf kapil kak said means Ka- kapil kak describes him in that way known as a man of few words a man of few words means a man who speaks very less singh was not only a fearless pilot but also had profound knowledge profound means so much knowledge about air power and applied it in a wide spectrum of areas means whatever knowledge he was having that knowledge he utilized in many different fields singh had assiduously assiduously means working hard and showing careful attention to details led the iaf during the 1965 war means when there was the war war of 1965 arjun singh had played a very important role in that and denied success to pakistani air force means very bravely he fought against the pakistani soldiers though it was better equipped with american support means at that point of time pakistani soldiers were getting the support from the american army but then also because of the courage and the bravery of arjun singh india got the victory in that war his most outstanding contribution was during the war said kak so kak says that he had contributed a lot during that war commending his role in the war here commending means officially praising yb chauhan the then defense minister means 
he was the defense minister at that point of time had written air marshal arjun singh is a jewel of a person quite efficient and firm unexcitable means he is very calm and cool he never loses his calmness but a very able leader so the defense minister of that time had praised arjun singh with these words in 1944 the marshal had led a squadron against the japanese during the arakan campaign flying close air support mission during the crucial crucial means important imphal campaign and later assisted assisted means helped the advance of the allied forces allied forces means combined forces when the soldiers of two three countries come together so they are called as allied forces to yangoon formerly known as rangoon in recognition of his feat feat means successful thing he was awarded the distinguished flying cross which is in short called as dfc on the spot by the supreme allied commander of southeast asia so for his contribution he was honored there the first indian pilot to have received it and arjun singh was the first indian pilot to receive that honor singh was selected for the empire pilot training course at royal air force which is called as raf Cranwell in 1938 when he was just 19 years old he retired from service in 1969 Singh was born on April 15 1919 in Lyallpur okay now it is in Faisalabad Pakistan and completed his education at Montgomery now Shival Pakistan his first assignment assignment means the task which is given to someone on being commissioned was to fly westland wapiti by planes in the north western frontier promise frontier means bordering area and province means area as a member of the number 1 RIAF squadron squadron it is a post after a brief stint brief stint means short period with the newly formed number 2 RIAF squadron where the marshal flew against the tribal forces he later moved back to number 1 squadron as a flying officer means very soon he was promoted to fly the hawker hurricane hawker hurricane what is it it is a type of aircraft he was promoted to the rank of squadron leader in 1944 means in this way we find that he did so much progress in a short span of time for his role in successfully leading the squadron in combat combat means battle fight he was awarded the distinguished flying cross dfc in 19 44 on august 15 1947 he achieved the unique honor of leading means guiding a fly past of over a 100 iaf fly past means a ceremonial flight of an aircraft passing over a place over the red fort in new delhi so that honor also he received after his promotion to the rank of wing commander he attended the royal staff college at the uk uk means united kingdom immediately after indian independence he commanded ambala in the rank of group captain so in this way he did the progress very fast and achieved so many titles and ranks in 1949 he was promoted to the rank of air commodore that is a post and took over as air officer commanding of an operational command which later came to be known as western air command 
Singh had the distinction of having the longest tenure means it was his special feature that he enjoyed the longest tenure tenure means the period of service as aoc of an operational base initially initially means in the beginning from 1949 to 1952 and then again from 1957 to 1961 after his promotion to the rank of air vice marshal he was appointed as the aoc nc of an operational command towards the end of the 1962 war he was appointed as the deputy chief of the air staff and he became the vice chief of the air staff in 1963 he was the overall commander of the joint air training exercise and that campaign was called as shiksha and this campaign was held between iaf and raf means indian air force and royal air force and raf royal australian air force so joint session was organized and arjun singh successfully led that campaign so students remaining part of the chapter i'll explain you in the next session till then it's goodbye